Hi guys, welcome back to my Xvius guide. Now I'm gonna talk about which items that you should get on this event. So yeah, if you need a guide for exploration and quest, you can visit my site. The link is provided below this video. Okay, so the first things you need to get on this event is these two equipment. The first one is Escachion. It is a very nice shield with undead killer ability okay so the cost of this escutcheon is very cheap only about 400 shards so make sure you get this first because yeah you can get it immediately after the event starts the second equipment is chiriji raden this is the best katana that is very easy to get the strongest katana on this game right now is sakura fubuki okay but the Katana is only obtainable from Trustmaster Reward. So this Katana is very easy to get compared to that Sakura Fubuki. Mm, so the cost of this Shiriji Raden is 3,700 shard. That makes the cost of getting this equipment is about 4,100 shard. The numbers are easily obtainable by farming elite or pro for about 4 days, okay. So yeah, those are for the equipments. Okay, so the other things that you need to get on this event is the star quartz and rare summon tickets. If you buy them all with equipments, they are all cost about 11,400 shard okay so that numbers of shard you can get it by farming on elite difficulty for six days and pro difficulty for eight days so after knowing this you not need to worry if you are not able to farm on elite difficulty because the pro difficulties is already enough to get all the important items why I don't why I say that other items are not important? So, okay, so let's talk about the skills, okay? The skills are only equipable by certain characters. Like you can see that second wins, Ramza only. And this stone throw is a joke, okay? I don't know why you want to get this skill. This skill only do about 400 damage. And the price is really expensive, 1,500 shot. Let's just forget this skill exists. So this skill is no-no on this event. So the second skill is Medicaid. Medicaid is actually quite good in theory, okay? So it cures poison, blind, and silence for caster. But it's only equipable by Agrias and Gafgarion. I say that this is not a good thing because they are attacker. I believe that if you want to cure someone from blind or other pet status, you need to use healer because by having them cure themselves, you just waste one turn from attacking. So yep, avoid this skill. Not mentioning the price is very expensive. Okay, even if you get Gafgarion or Agrias later, it is still not worth to get. So maybe the only worth skill is Crush Armor, but it's only equipable for Delita. Okay, so unless you get him, which I believe that almost all of you would not, it is better to avoid this one. And the price is very crazy, 6000 for only defense and spirit. The skill is really outclassed by full break, so if you already have other characters that have full break, avoid this skill, okay? So yeah, the skill is also not worth in my opinion, especially you have the Alita and have excessive amount of shot. So the last skill is second win. This one is also useless because Ramza is 5 stars best 
which is also as rare as Lightning and Delita. And yeah, not many players will get this Ramza. So this skill is also not good because Ramza is like your attacker. He is not a support. So using him to support is not that good. And it all and the second win only targets one target, which is really mm, bad in my opinion because the duration only three turns and you need to cast it every turn. If you need support, then don't use Ramza. Use other heroes. Okay, he is main attacker, so this skill is useless in Ramza in my opinion. So yeah, the skills like you can see now that the skills are not that good. So avoid them. The skills are your last priority on this event. So the second priority is this six stars awakening material. So if you have got all the recommended items on this video, I suggest you to spend your shirt on this six stars awakening. Okay, so later if one of your heroes get an upgrade to become six stars, you can evolve them as soon as possible. But if you don't have enough shard to get this all, it is okay because they always available in upcoming event, okay? So yeah, this is not your priority at this moment unless you have get the Lita and Lightning or Ramza. So yeah, leave this six stars awakening material because they also take your inventory space. Inventory space is not free so yeah try to not fill your material slot with unusable items so yeah i believe those are all you need to know about the which item that you should get on this event if you need a guide for exploration and more detailed about calculation on shard you can visit my site Okay, you can find the link below this video, below this video. Okay, guys. Yep, that's all. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more Final Fantasy Brave Exvius Guide. Bye.